So today we saw these workers at Marvel um, win their election. So what does that mean? Um, I mean, ultimately, this isn't a campaign that's about a single studio or a project. This is about visual effects workers, you know, throughout the industry demanding respect for the work that they do. But, you know, especially for Marvel workers where we couldn't have superheroes flying or battling or fighting or morphing or anything without visual effects. So when you have a, a whole brand that really does rely on, upon the work that we do, um, I think that really speaks to the reasonableness of what we're talking about, right? What we're really asking for is to be paid fairly for the hours that we work, um, to be given, you know, the basic quality of life stuff like health insurance that will travel from job to job with us, like a, pay, a retirement fund, like meal penalty protections that we aren't forced to work through lunch, um, like turnaround protections. I think that when you have workers who are so vital to providing uh, the work that makes these projects possible, asking for these very reasonable demands that will make their lives more sustainable and allow them to continue to exercise uh, their skills and experience at a top level, um, this should be a win-win for both sides. If you are at a studio of your own, you can do exactly what these workers did. It starts with talking to your coworkers, the people sitting right next to you, and ultimately reach out to us at vfxunion.org and we can connect you and ultimately build a supermajority as we've seen at Disney and Marvel in a matter of months. And it's the same if you're working at the vendor side. You know, we would seek to include 80% of you to make a near unanimous demand for representation. This is a grassroots campaign that puts the voices of the workers first and the union is, is you, the workers. Um, this is not about IATSE coming in and you know, rescuing us. This is about VFX workers uplifting themselves um, and you know, with the support um, of IATSE ultimately being able to negotiate a collective uh, bargaining agreement that would improve all of our conditions. We have many more, uh, you know, campaigns uh, in the future, and um, ultimately, every person in visual effects should be able to find their home in this new national local union. Thank you so much for watching our video. If you'd like to see more stories like this one, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel to get more, more perfect union in your feed. And if you have any ideas for stories that you would like for us to investigate, just drop them in the comments below.